so today we are going to analyze our pk file in blue team labs so here is the file which we have to do in this attack we have to analyze a pk file where webcell attack is done so first of all let's download it i already have downloaded it let me show you i have put it in my file let's go to there okay here in stock analysis file here you go you, you are able to see that i have already downloaded and unzip it okay let's go to our wire shark and open the file and let's start the analysis of the file okay let's go our wire shark is going starting okay let's import the file okay here is our file let's import it yeah, done here is the our pk file so we have to analyze it for a web cell attack so first of all let's see what are the protocols running on it so let's see it by protocol or sorry here we are go we are able to see the all the protocols are running in this pk file which have been captured so let's analyze it so here we are able that http means uh, we are investigating for our web cell so http is little bit suspicious for us so it's a point point which are given by the blue team labs to us so let's read it and start investigating so first of all let's see the all the conversations done in this pk file so for this we are going to analyze the conversation so here we are able that here we go we are able to see that the ip address is sending a lot of packets in which we are able to know that it's doing a it's doing a scan in the internal networks we are able to get it from this so it's confirmed that this IP address start start scanning the internal IP address of the same the company. So let's answer where it is correct. Okay. Let's analyze other questions. So what ports are scanned? So let let's analyze it. While seeing it, we are able to see that the ports which are scanned are mainly from one to one zero two four, mainly top thousand ports. So it's little bit confirmed that it's scanned from one port to one zero two four ports. Maybe this will be answered. So, so let's answer where it. Let's see, is the our answer is the right or not? So let's put our answer here. Maybe it will be right or wrong. Yes, it's right. So let's see the other questions and check it in our PK file. Okay, let's see. Let's put a filter. As we know the IP address which is scan the internal IP address so let's put it in here and search for it that what first type of scan is run. So as we are able to see that the scan run from a cyanic, cyanic packet so we are able to know that the, that the type of the scan of the port which is held is a TCP cyanic attack. So maybe that will be the answer so let's answer with it and know that it's right or wrong. As we are able to see that the first scan is done by a signed packet. So let's see other things what we will get. As we are able to see the other things which are not which are not important for us. So let's close it and let's answer where it our answer is TCP signing. So let's see is it right or wrong? It's right. Okay. And the second question is what are the tools and their versions which are used to scan the internal IP addresses? So as we know that whenever a tool is scanning a particular network then it's leave its little bit of evidences in the user agent. So let's see the user agents as we already know the IP addresses and the user agents. So let's put a filter here and start scanning. As while well, analyzing we are able to see the things let's our main focus is to see the user agents 
okay let's see the user agents let's analyze it as you know user agents are always using http and user https so here we go we are able to see the user agents and their versions used in this scanning okay okay let's analyze it quickly let me analyze it quickly and answer where it okay then we are proceeding for the further analysis of the pk file okay let's wait for a second let's go for a one by one packet as we already know that the first tool which is used is cobuster and here we go we found then the second tool which is used to scan the network is uh, I think it's a SQL map yeah right it's a SQL map got it we got it right it's a SQL map okay let's see okay let's see everything yeah here we got it I know the answer was answer was already because I have already analyzed it and completed it well that's why I know the answer very but when you have, whenever you start the analysis of the pickup file then you have to do a lot of things i think you guys are knowing here we got a file which is uploaded the function.php okay let's see tcp system maybe this is the file which is uploaded and got the for getting the website from the website so let's analyze it okay let's analyze it later first of all let's answer where the questions okay what are the tools and their versions okay let's censor with it as we know that the tools are used are gobuster and sql map let's censor with it quickly okay here we go the versions okay let's analyze it quickly Let's wait for a I think we are facing a little bit of problem for analyzing the versions of the SQL map and Coaster. Okay, let's do it quickly. Maybe I have to put cuts on the videos, so don't worry for that. I have already done it. That's why I know all the answer base of the questions. Okay, here we got it the answers great so let's answer very it quickly and let's answer very it quickly yeah it's right okay as we analysis we got the file which has been uploaded from a particular path and a file name is defunction so let's answer very it quickly as we know that the file which is uploaded and maybe the malicious file and we when tcp scanned it we got that it's malicious which is db function file dot php file so let's quickly analyze that too and confirm that the file which is uploaded is malicious or not so let's see
as we know that the post request is used to submit something to the website so let's filter it out by a post request of http and quickly analyze it so as we are able to see that the things which are submitted to the website by using a post request are given as shown here sorry for that misspell slip of the tongue okay let's quickly analyze it okay 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 let's analyze it quickly okay nothing let's analyze other things other other mm, let's see that we got something or not let's give me a let me give a second okay let's analyze it analyze it analyze analyze here we got it let's see the tcp stream of this here we got it we are at that the malicious file which is uploaded in dfunction.php got it and let's let's see here is a particular thing parameter which is running by this file which is cmd means command and up and some html so php which are running here so let's see other things that may be important for us or not nothing here is the parameter which is used in this file okay we got it right let's answer very quickly to our answers means question sorry for slip of tongue and the file which got is db function.php let's answer very quickly and the second question that what the path where from the file uploaded so let's see it quickly here analyzing the file we got the answer also here we got let's answer very quickly to edit profile.php is our answer here we got it you are in the right part guys don't worry and what's the parameter that cmd as we already know and what's the first command after executing so to find out this we have to see that what in the files which contains the cmd what the commands are executed by this that so let's see in this um nothing so let me close one window first mm, here nothing we got nothing in this tcp stream so let's quickly close it and analyze for the further analysis of this pcap file okay nothing nothing it contain nothing important for us okay Mm, nothing nothing important in this okay let's quickly close it and analyze for the further analysis of this pk file let's start pk file okay okay nothing so let's put me a filter in this and to find out what the things which are used and as what the command first execute by the attacker after getting the where's web cell okay As we know that HTTP is used and the file which is uploaded is DB function dot PHP. So let's use a filter which is HTTP contains DB function dot PHP which help us to identify that the file which contain contains DB function dot PHP and after that what the things are executed after that. So let me put the filter here. HTTP contains DB function. Okay. here we got the packets so let's quickly analyze the first one is nothing important mm, it contains mm, it contains nothing important like us let's second the second packet is two zero two double zero okay it's not important let's see the third one mm, nothing important fourth mm, here we got it here we got it the first command executed by the attacker is id this is used to identify the id of the profile of the machine after getting the web cell the attacker first used the id function and the third here we got that something malicious code is ran 
which is python and after analyzing it we already, we know that it's a reversal okay done and here is the ip address and the port number which the attacker is used to get the reversal or the rc from the web server so let's quick, let me quickly show you here is the ip address of the attacker and the second one is the port used by the attacker so let's quickly copy it answer and answer where the following questions which are asked by us so let's quickly answer them as you know the first command is id so let's answer it and the we already not analyzed it that first reversal so let's quickly answer where this two okay and the third one is the port okay let's we have already solved this network analysis